Ganga Maya, a Tamang who had been raped by Rampadur Bomjon in 2016 when she was only 14 years old and she was a nun. Uh, this police report had been placed in Sarlahi district and Nepali media online cover uh, wrote a detailed article about the raid which was unsuccessful. According to the media there was no SIM card locator to uh, locate Bomjon in the ashram and there was a lack of technology so that's why Bomjon allegedly could escape. The police raid was under the direction of Home Ministry Secretary Maheshwar Neupane, Inspector General of Police Thakur Prashad Giavali and Bureau Chief Thakul Sahakul Tapa and they went to search for Bomjon uh, by the team which was led by SP Pandey and they had truck and search rescue dogs with them. Now I am uh, translating the online cover article. Online cover also showed a few very interesting photos uh, which they made during the uh, police raid. So the first photo is about the police and CIB, which is the secret police of Nepal, uh, searching for Bomjon in the Sinduli ashram, when at point they decided to check Bomjon's nuns quarters, and here we see the nuns, because they had a feeling that Bomjon could be hiding as a woman among the nuns, but this had been not proved. What is interesting, we see one dog here, online cover is writing that in the nun's house there were too many dogs, what is very surprising for them. Why? Next photo uh, is apparently Rambom John's um, bedroom. Uh, it looks like newly made and uh, doesn't look like it was ever used, but of course we don't know. And uh, this is uh, about the police raid. They were giving the dogs to uh, feel the scent, the, feel the smells in the room. And uh, textiles and the furniture in the house, according to online cover is uh, all uh, foreign made. So we know that Ram Bomjon has a lot of uh, foreigner supporters and sponsors, especially from Southeast Asia, uh, like Taiwan, Malaysia, Singapore, Korea, Thailand, Vietnam, Japan, and uh, Chinese speaking country countries including mainland China so there is a lot of donation in these uh, traditionally Buddhist countries and Bomjon became very rich and started to live very luxuriously due to this foreign help according to online cover in this villa he even has a swimming pool and a gym the next photo is showing the special device used in the 2015 Nepali earthquakes which can locate living beings under the earth. Unfortunately, it just happened that during this police raid, this uh, life, location, lo life locator machine stopped to work. Actually, why did they uh, use this machine was that Bom Jones' own followers, the blue-robed uh, people living in his court, in his compound, instructed the police that Bom Jones is doing his meditation underground. Uh, needless to mention that 
uh, neither did they find him nor the machine worked. Then we see the police raid going to the jungle. Uh, we see one policeman sitting tired on the stone. This police raid of allegedly 150 policemen and CIB, which is the security, uh, I mean, secret services of Nepal. This police raid was going on from four o'clock early in the morning until two o'clock in the afternoon on the 18th of June 2020, but they didn't have any lead, so they were like going blindly. Uh, they had the rescue dogs, which lost the the, they lost the lead, lost the track by uh, crossing this river, so they had to repeat the uh, smelling of the materials again, and it was not successful. Uh, obviously, we don't see any hurry in this police raid. Uh, police raids should be quick, and sharp, not just like walking around and giving enough time to people to run away. But what we see already from this photo is that some policeman is sitting around, some is chatting with the local people, uh, they're looking left or right, so anyone who is not entirely stupid and uh, is a criminal uh, would hear the dogs barking, would see the policeman walking in a relaxed way, so anyone could easily escape from this police. The police came when it was still dark at four o'clock, but similarly as during the February 2020 police raid, also this police raid had an informer which warned Rambom John to escape. Uh, Reed was not equipped with a basic SIM card locator and the machines which were using were out of order. Here we see uh, the photo of Bom John's meeting room in a very relaxed way, standing around, chatting with the followers and no, there is no hurry in police raid in Nepal so it's very easy to escape if this and this I would not call a police raid and this is Bom John's car uh, allegedly the car one of the many cars that he is allegedly using